Hey everybody, it's Christina. Today I wanted to share with you my new Filofax. This is the pocket-sized Filofax. It's um, the Aston um, Pocket Organizer in Orchid. And it's um, right now, it, normally it's $115. Right now it's $45, I think it is, on their website. So I decided to pick it up because I was actually on um, Vera Bradley's website and I was ready to order a new wallet, one that would match my current purse. Um, this one, I have a purple purse and this one just doesn't match. Then I decided I wanted to get something that was more permanent that I didn't have to worry about because with Vera Bradley that p bothers me if they clash. Um, so... I wanted to get something that I knew I would be able to use with any purse I was carrying, so I got this. So let me just show you what it looks like. It comes in this little black box, and um, let me show you what the organizer looks like. Now I said this is an orchid. On the website it looks a little bit more purple than it does in person. It has a little Filofax tissue paper. In person it's a little bit more of a burgundy color, um, not quite as, as a purpley as it shows on the website. Um, in the bottom of the box there's the 2012 um, page, or page daily page things and then there's also one of the little um, Filofax rulers, the black one, in there but it also has a ruler inside. Um, my plan with this is, like I said, is to use it as a wallet and I really love the uh, stitching on the front. It has some really nice little um, uh, angles to it and it has the Filofax emblem on the side and that's the back. It has a button closure and on the side here it has uh, four little uh, card pockets so I'm going to be probably using that for my driver's license and my most used credit cards and then it has a full pocket here so I really love it. and this leather is so soft. I mean really flexible. That's what I like about it. Um, my A2 size one, and I'll show you that one at the end if you didn't see that video. It's nice and flexible and it lets you kind of gives you some a lot of room. So you can see how much room is in there and it's going to be able to, if I have stuff piled in there, that it won't be too bad. So this comes with um, the uh, Filofax 2013 uh, daily calendar. So, and I'm not going to be using this. I have my A2 or A5, and I'm going to be using that for my daily stuff. This, like I said, is just strictly going to be my wallet, so I won't be using this. But this does have the daily pages. Um, it's a week per two page spread. And it comes with a brown ruler. And you can see, it's hard to tell in the video, but you can really tell the difference in the color with the black. So I really love it. It's brown with cream lettering. And actually the paper in this is cream colored, it's not the, the white like in my other one. Um, and then it also has, that's the rest of the calendar, it also has the little file tabs. It has um, the uh, diary, a section for notes, information, financial address, has a couple sheets of the to-do list, it has lined paper, and then it has the address section along with um, the uh, ABC tabs. In the back here it's got a full back section that has a zipper so it's probably where I'll stick my cash and then it has also a pencil or pen loop. So that is the Filofax. Let me show you, um, first let me measure this, let me find my ruler uh, just so you can get an idea of how big it is. Um, this one measures, uh, it's about four inches by five and three quarter inches and let me show you compared to my A5 and A5 is the biggest one that they have so that's my A5 which is the Finsbury this is the Aston and that's an, it's it's a perfect size for a wallet at least I think it is I know a lot of people use the personal size as their wallets I, I don't have I mean I carry a big purse but I also carry tons of other things to work so this is perfect for me and I'll be able to you know have that compared to my Vera Bradley wallet, that's about the size. It's about the same height and um, just a couple of inches shorter than my Vera Bradley. It's about two inches shorter than my Vera Bradley wallet. And um, I don't keep a ton of stuff in my wallet because I keep a whole bunch of other Vera Bradley little things in my purse that I keep it all in. So I'm hoping that I'll be able to keep everything right inside here. Let me show you what else I purchased with my order. 
Um, like I said, this is on sale 60% off. It's normally $115. Um, so I was thrilled to get it for $45. I think that's a really good deal considering that it is, is leather and it has such great stitching details. And it smells great. So anyway, I got four of the credit card pocket holders so that I can keep all of my, my discount cards and stuff in there. I purchased one of the Ziploc envelopes. So this is the pocket size Ziploc envelopes. So you can see it has a little zipper. And in here I think I'm going to keep my, my change or something like that. Then I also purchased the ruled note paper, another little pad of ruled, ruled note paper. Um, there's not a lot in here and I kind of wish I bought another one. So I may have to order another package of those because there was something else I wanted and I didn't buy. And um, so I want to get those. This one is the month uh, on two page calendar and what I did with what I'm going to do with this one that is not this is the month on two page calendar I've got my little things um, the month on two page oh <laughs> okay so I also picked up the month on two page calendar with the monthly tabs so I got the 2013 one and it has all of the little tabs and what I wanted to do with this is if something should come up that um, when I'm out and I'm making an appointment like for my hair like a hair appointment or something comes up at work that I need to do something special I can write it all inside of my file effects that's in my purse and then transfer it over to my big file effects that has my home stuff in it um, so it has just the dates and then a single line after it so that I can just write that information in so that's the tabbed the tabbed um, monthly calendar and then I got the month on two page calendar so I can actually do stuff like birthdays and holidays and stuff like that. Um, it's very similar to the, there's a lot of extra papers in here. It's very similar to the uh, the larger one that I have in my A5. So it has the, the whole calendar spread and the dates on the side. And I have to be honest, I get it's really hard for me to get used to that because um, I'm used to doing things Sunday through Saturday and not Monday through Sunday so um, it's kind of confusing for me but that's what that looks like and it's very similar to what I have in my um, my large file of facts let me get to that section here which I just did the video on this um, not too long ago so this is our July month of July so it's the same thing just a smaller version of it so so that's my new file of facts I'll probably come back with another video to show you how I set it up to work as my wallet. Thanks for watching and I'll see you all next time.